in the Kenyan maximum security prisons, there is an offense, if you can call it that, called kuiba jua. Kuiba jua is equivalent to stealing the sun. Now, how can you steal a star which is several times bigger than the earth? Uh, when I talked of that, I was attacked and uh, I was talking of, uh, you know, when you're in the maximum security prison, you are only allowed to be in the sun for 30 minutes. But a prominent person used to have other privileges. When I talked of that, I was really attacked. I was talked that I was being bought. I was being sending uh, whatever. And um, seven to ten days after I had said, the very same VIP whom I had talked about uh, having access to through a prison warder produced during a public an ODM public meeting in Voi produced a, a former warden called John Somebody. I produced that John to the crowd and told them that uh, this is the person who used to uh, be the intermediate between me and Ida. And uh, an impromptu harambe was done and that ex-prison warder uh, suddenly had 100,000 shillings. So what I say here uh, I just say what I know. I'm not there to blast one side or clean another side. But today's topic is about Kuiba Jua stealing the sun. What used to happen is that uh, one had to look for a way of extending his, on a few occasions, her. Uh, the, you had to find a, a way of extending the 30 minutes to be 31 or 32. Even if you are beaten up, you know, when you, you, you didn't have a watch, you didn't have a table, but there was a way you could know how, there was a way you could know that the 30, it's now 28, 29 minutes, and 30 minutes is approaching. So you'd try to go to the farthest end, and then uh, when they, 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 they lead you back into the cells, you, they'll drag you. And in the process of dragging you and beating you up, instead of uh, having 30 minutes uh, of uh, sun, you'll have 32 or 33. Uh, that is what used to happen. But then I had talked of on the aspect of the detainees. And you know detainees, at no time, I don't think there is a time when detainees were more than 30 at, at a go. I don't think that Kenya has ever had more than 30 detainees at a go. But we also have capital offenders. Capital offenders, we have uh, police offenders. You know, if you are a former police officer and you are taken to court, you are jailed. Uh, it, it, it is risky for you to go and be detained in the same cells with the people. It is even possible for you to be in the same cells with the people you jailed. And um, these people are locked up very early. Uh, someone even said as early as 4 p.m., you are locked there between 4 p.m. and the following day, 5 a.m. And that would even lead for your death or something like that. So what used to happen is that, um, or what happens now, I don't know whether it's still there, is that uh, police officers, uh, prosecutors and such people are kept in a different block. They are kept in a different block. Even magistrates and so on, uh, they are placed in the same uh, block with mad people and such things. Uh, and then um, there are those uh, prefects. We can call them prefects. They are called trustees. Trustees comes from the word trusted. Trustees even put on a different uniform. Uh, these trustees are people who have served for a long time, and even after serving for a long time, they have become so trusted that uh, during uh, people going to farms, they are given, they can even operate the tractors. 
and even when prisoners are in the farm they can even supervise those prisoners these are people whom even if they had a chance to escape they'll not escape because this is somebody who is serving 20 years jail and he has completed 15 years uh, the remaining five if you escape and you are caught you'll complete the five and also you'll have to go you'll also be charged with the uh, escape from a lawful uh, custody and the so it has reached a stage there where he's so used to the place that um, even if he had a chance he would not escape these are the people now who organize block a to go for the now I, I I had talked of Kuiba Jua on political detainees. Now I'm talking of Kuiba Jua generally, including maximum security prison. So you find the maximum security prison, prisoners who are there on a capital, uh, who are there on a capital offense. Uh, capital offense is the an offense where there is only one sentence, and that is death. Uh, in Kenya. Death is only through hanging, but in other countries, death can happen through shooting, electric shock, electric chair. They also have uh, uh, poisoned injection and so on. Those people are those people who also have sunshine for one hour. Now, we were having a, a, a sit down, uh, was chaired by Dr. Kingori, and we had two. Uh, people who spend a lot of one had spent 18 years in committee and another one had spent five years in committee but uh, i got an impression that corruption is even in the prison so that um, let's say block a they are going for 30 minutes block b uh, follows by 30 minutes block c 30 minutes block d 30 minutes that is four times 30 those are two hours but in practical those are two and a half hours because when you take out block A, they complete their 30 minutes and then you are supposed to take them back and then lock them, then take blo block B and then block B have their 30 minutes. Then, you know that ch exchange would add an half an hour or more. So if you are in committee and uh, you are well pocketed, trustees can be given something so that uh, maybe... Uh, when you're in block A, and um, when you're in block A, and you you are taken to to bask in the sun, uh, when block A are being returned by trustees, not even prison warders, or even prison warders, if we could say, you stay longer. The, the, when the last group block D have gone through, remember just. 30, 30, 30 times 4, that is mm, 2 hours. And then, uh, uh, let's say half an hour of interchangeability, you'll have basked in the sun for 2 and a half hours. That, viewers, is kuiba jua or stealing the sun. And it is one of the worst offenses someone can do when he, really she, when he, is in maximum security prison.